What's up guys, it's me, Onika321, and I'm making another tutorial for you. This time, we're focusing on pneumatic tubing. Yep, these things. But I'm also going to add in some red uh, redstone tubes and some other tubes. Uh, restriction tubes. One sec, doing DND on Skype. Right, so what, what are pneumatic tubes? Well, if I start this off, make this a bit faster. It, it transports stuff from one place to another, like this. And they're uh, pretty much the most effective way of doing so. So it, this will slowly fill up, right? And you know the way in Billcroft pipes, they drop their stuff after the you know, chest entirely fill up. Instead of doing that, it puts all the stuff going back. It makes the stuff go back, so everything's now stored inside the filter. So I'll stop this again. So, what can you use? You can already see the possibilities of this. You can now make your factories without any need to destroy anything, etc. etc. Um, here we've got another setup. This time, um, it's. I'm going to show you the restriction tubes. It's different, I, would, I guess. So, um, oops, sorry, I'm lagging a bit for some reason. Um, say, say I stick a ton of stuff in this chest, right? Uh, just take a lot of dirt and some colored wool. So everything goes in. Right, so it transports everything around but pneumatic tubings usually go to the first thing possible. So if I remove this and add this here, it will, they will go here. But with restriction tubes, they just go all around. Another, aw another awesome thing which I can do, however, Instead of doing that, if I release, if I um, turn this off and release everything that's in here, um, eventually this chest here will fill up. Uh, one second. Let's <laughs> like a stack in here and make this all orange. <laughs> So that will fill up and it will start filling the first thing up, right? But if I um, get another chest, if I get another chest and a restriction tube here, so there's two restriction tubes instead of one, when this fills up, which will be very soon by the looks of it, it will skip this one and go to the next one. Now say for example I want them to really skip this one and make this last, I put three, I put three inside of there instead of two, and now it will go down, it, the order is now going to be from that chest to this chest to this chest to this chest. Watch. See? Restriction tubes, they like um, stack up. So, so like that. And it sends the information down the pneumatic tubing saying there's um, space. So yeah. You can see all the possibilities of that. Now, if you don't want to use red, a lot of redstone wiring for all your stuff, what you can do instead is use um, redstone pipes. They carry redstone the same way that a redstone current is. They have the same rules as a redstone current also. Um, but yeah. Um, but they send all the information down to the stuff at the end. So you need to use redstone. You can't use... Um, the red alloy, red, the red wire thingy, this one, red, yeah, red alloy wire, I was, I was correct the first time, because it doesn't connect at all, like, you can just keep trying, but it won't connect, look, that sends power, but it doesn't go to here, for some reason, so, if we just get free for one again, uh, hmm, but yeah, instead, Oh right, it filters the wrong way, that's why. I'm gonna be doing a tutorial on filter soon, don't worry. Look, then they send stuff, uh, and also other redstone -y stuff. So now, they're sending a redstone power, and to prove it also, this is halfway down, and it sends all the way down to there. So if I get redstone tube... One, two... I think that's the uh, furthest distance it can go. I can't remember exactly. Is it this? Take a chest. And also, another thing which is a actual benefit of this, which is getting the timer, stick it down here, is that it doesn't send anything down. 
if there's nothing to put it into. Say for example, just stick this again full of colourful wool. Look, there's um, power going to it. No, there isn't. <laughs> Apparently. If I stick the tower next to it. Wait, no, it's just broken. Oh, that's why. See, it, it was trying to send it, but it's, it's not, it can't send it anywhere. Also, time is st sticking right next to it doesn't work, right work. That's why. Sorry, I was a bit confused. So, it doesn't send it until you stick a place for it to go, and then it goes. So, it has the same characteristics as redstone, so... Um, up to here... It is, you can see the slight flashing of redstone first you get a timer, so... Nope, not a timer, a repeater. I can't spell, it's just so cold in my house. It's impeding my spelling. <laughs> Stick two of them. Three techs each. Look. It goes up. If I change the darkness, actually, you might be able to hear it, see it better. Well, you can't. You can barely see it still. But as you can see, it it stops at this point here and doesn't carry on. I'm gonna change it back to day. So it stops here. The redstone starts taking the stops here. But if I move it so it's two blocks up, just two blocks. So just I'll just stick it here actually you can send stuff down. So you can see also see the possibilities of this and I think also No, it doesn't take it doesn't output power. But yeah, these are all the these are all the tubes that you can use. So you can stack them up. Um, you can use restrictions restriction tubes to stack them up like this. You can use um redstone tubes to be able to transport stuff like that. Or you can just use normal pneumatic tubing along the pipe. Uh, I don't think I've missed anything. Let me just check. <laughs> Other than that, yeah, mm. this is everything you need to know. Uh, I forgot to tell you one thing. Actually, there's only one more thing. If I get a paintbrush, paintbrush like an orange and a magenta one and I want stuff to I've got two lines of stuff um, and I want them to be separate what I can do is I can change this one one color so this is like using stone stone the uh, build craft pipes and one of them orange and as you can see they don't join to each other meanwhile if they're uncolored or one of them is colored or if only just one of them is colored then they just connect to each other this doesn't work with. Oh no, it does work. <laughs> it does work with the um these, but they connect together still. Doesn't make it so yeah. And restriction pipes. You can also change to the appropriate color. So anyway, I hope you found this tutorial helpful. As you can see, as you can see, there's lots of stuff you can do with um these beautiful pneuma um, pneumatic tube, well, tube, red book, red power tubes, I can't talk. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. This is me, Onika321, signing out. Peace out, guys.